Radio Raheem down here at Wildcard Boxing Gym ran into another champion on a day in which we are reflecting on the greatest champion this sport of boxing has ever known, Muhammad Ali. I'm talking to Justin Juco, who usually will not allow you to take any photos, no photos, no video, but on this very special day, he's allowing us to talk to him on camera. And I just want briefly, champ, your thoughts on a fellow champion, Muhammad Ali. Well, Muhammad Ali, like I always say, Bomaye, the man was the epitome of sports. I mean, to me and actually to the world, Muhammad Ali is the best that sportsman that has ever lived on the face of the earth by none. If you put all the sports together, none can beat Ali. Because now, if you look at other sports people, uh, they always respected Ali. You can put maybe 20 of them, all the sports, and Ali will stand out. So, that there. And the thing what our, our, our league got into going to being the best at what he do and outside the ring itself. Ali uh, advocated for more than sports, you know. He was a sportsman, yes, but he was, uh, you know, like activist, you know, uh, human rights and all that. That's how he became so big. That's why all these years up to, up to now, even when, as, when he's dead, he's going to still, his name will still live on. So... And actually, for me, I'm happy that uh, I had an opportunity, you know, <laughs> to meet him, be at my fights, and uh, hey. Talk to me about the time you met him. Oh, well, I met Ali. I was fighting uh, Diego Colales on the same bay with uh, De La Hoya and, uh, and Mosley at their Staples Center. We opened our fights. It was the first title fight at the Staples Center, me and uh, Diego. Ali was there. Everybody was there. But uh, what surprised me and everybody was... In spite of the fact that all the sports, I mean, all the top international people are there, everybody was on Ali. <laughs> that's enough. Ali was Ali, and it's going to be Ali, and that's it. You know, a lot of people don't realize, especially younger people, the impact that he had on the world, not just America, not just yeah. boxing. Yeah. You being from Uganda, can you talk to me about the impact Muhammad Ali had on Africa? Oh, Ali, uh, Ali uh, put Africa on the map of the world. When Ali fought uh, uh, George Foreman in 74, I mean, the whole world looked, looked at Africa. That was in Zaire, you know. Mm -hmm. Actually, up to now, they still talk about it. That just shows you that Ali was the man. That's it. Radio Rahim with the Ugandan destroyer, Justin Ali. Juko. Bumaye, Ali, Bumaye, Ali, Bumaye. Bumaye. Number one, man.